everybody, welcome back to my channel. If it is your first time here, hello, so very glad to have you. If you have come looking for subscription box unboxings, you have found the right place. On this channel, we literally do like a million beauty unboxings, so if you enjoy unboxings, go ahead and subscribe because this is the channel for you. However, because we do do so many beauty unboxings, I am finally realizing that I think it might be just a few too many. Just like, just like a couple too many. So hopefully I can enlist the help of all of you guys in trying to pare down some of my subscriptions. I am not a wealthy person and I'm spending a whole lot of money on subscriptions. Now of course I really do love unboxing subscriptions, I love sharing them with you guys, but at the same time it's getting like maybe a little too much. So unfortunately I'm going to have to part ways with a couple of my subscriptions, but I just cannot choose which one. It's like picking a child to like send away. Like I just really, <laughs> it's a little dramatic, but I just really cannot pick which ones to cancel. So the first one up for trial today is Allure Beauty Box. We are going to get into this thing and see if it's worth holding on to or if I should just send it to the chopping block. Allure Beauty Box is a $15 a month subscription, but I'm currently getting mine for like $10.60 because of some type of promotion that I did a few months back. Eventually that promotion will run out and I don't really know when that happens, but as soon as it does, I'll be paying $15 for this box instead of 10. So I'm definitely gonna keep that in mind as I'm unboxing it. So let's just go ahead and get into March's box right here and see what we got. All right, every month on top, you're gonna get this little like magazine pamphlet thing and it'll tell you all the items that come inside of your box. I'm gonna be setting this aside because I don't want any surprises to be ruined, but we will look back to this later for prices and product information. All right, this is so far Oh no, don't fall out. Oh gosh. <laughs> we almost lost it all. Alright, so far this is what the box looks like this month. Right on top we have something from Secret Deodorant. And I thought this was going to be like a coupon or something, but it's just a little like advertisement pamphlet. And I see why it's in there, because they sent a little tiny thing of a Secret Deodorant. This little thing of deodorant here is definitely a travel size, and it is in the fragrance Cool Lily. Um, I guess let's just go ahead and give it a sniff. I don't really know how you test out deodorant on camera, but... I can definitely smell it. It smells nice. It's a very nice, like, fresh, florally type scent. Um, I don't really know how to review deodorant, but it smells like it would be good, I guess. You can typically get little deodorants like this at the store for like a dollar, so I'm not crazy excited about the first thing I pulled out of here, but let's keep moving on and see what else we have. All right, next up in here, I'm seeing a little blue thing, and this is a John Frieda Luxurious Volume, seven day volume in shower treatment. Okay, at first I thought this was a shampoo, and I was like, eh, another tiny little sample I could get for a dollar, but this is actually a treatment and not a shampoo, so this is supposed to give you seven days worth of volume. You guys can probably tell that my hair doesn't have crazy amounts of volume, so hopefully this will help it out. It says that it's supposed to amplify thickness, which I'm all about. Like, my hair is basically just like straight cotton candy, just like thin pieces of cotton candy. So anything that'll make it a little bit more thick, a little bit more luxurious, I'm definitely all about. All right, let's go back in here and see what else we have. I'm seeing this tiny little box, which looks absolutely adorable. This is from Acar Skin Ruby Tint Lip Butter. Ooh, that sounds adorable. This is the little box here. It is absolutely tiny, so I'm guessing the product itself will be tiny. All right, here is the itty bitty little tiny lip butter. It is in a very pretty red shade. This is what it looks like inside the little pot here. It is a quite bright color, but it shouldn't be too crazy pigmented because it is just a tint. Just rubbing my finger in it, it actually feels quite nice on the finger. I feel like it'll be super moisturizing on the lips. I'm gonna put a little on the back of my hand just so you guys can see the color. Here it is on the back of the hand. It is a very pretty color. I actually prefer it to be like a nice sheer pink rather than this bright, bold red, but that is just me. It does feel like it'll be extra moisturizing and probably feel very nice on the lips. All right, let's go ahead and grab these two things out, which I'm pretty sure are a set. We appear to have two things for our nails. We have a lacquer and then just a cur or cure, I'm guessing. I'm pretty sure it's a play on words like lacquer and then cure. I really don't know. But anyway, this one I think is a nail polish and this one is a cuticle oil. You guys can see I made an attempt today to paint my nails. I'm just really not good at keeping them like nice looking. I really tried. They're all like dented and weird and covered in makeup. I don't know. So I might get some use out of these, but I also might not. I have a giant like 
bucket. Like it's a full bucket, full of nail polishes that I barely, barely use. This however does look like a very pretty color, just nice and neutral, great for spring. It's in the shade Cheerio, which is adorable. This nourishing cuticle oil, I have definitely never used a cuticle oil in my life before, but I will definitely give it a try because my cuticles are a disaster. They're pretty, pretty bad. So hopefully this will make them not so terrible. Um, yeah, let's just, let's hope that's what happens. All right, guys, last little product in here before we decide this box fate. We have the Vitamin C Derma E Vitamin C Concentrated Serum with Hyaluronic Acid. That was a lot of things to say at one time. Just a little face serum here with a nice little pump at the top. Apparently this has a vitamin C in it. You're just supposed to apply it to your face and neck and rub it around. Vitamin C is supposed to be very good for your skin, so I will definitely be giving this a shot. And if I do really end up enjoying any of these things and I want to buy the full size, the prices are in here. So the lip butter is $28 for the full size. The Derma E Vitamin C Serum is $20. The John Frieda Volume and Shower Treatment is $9.99, which isn't really bad. The London Downtown Lacquer is $16, $16, oh my gosh. Nail polish is so expensive. And then the cuticle oil is $18. So these two things alone really do make up the price of the box, definitely for $10.50. Like I'm getting my value just from these two things. But overall, am I super excited about this box? I really don't think so. I really don't know. I'm almost leaning to like canceling it. I know I've only had it for a couple of months, but I, I did try earlier. I did try it quite a while ago to get this box for like four straight months and I could never get my hands on it for many different reasons. Um, but now that I have it, I was excited about last month and now I'm just not really sure. So I'm gonna throw my vote into the ring and tell you guys whether I wanna keep her canceled, but this channel isn't just about me. These boxes aren't just about me. I wanna know what you guys wanna see unboxed. So I'm personally gonna go ahead and say cancel for Allure Beauty Box, but I really, really wanna know your all's opinions. So down below, please tell me either keep or cancel. If this is a box that you guys wanna see like continuously every month, then I will definitely keep it. This channel is not just about me. Or if you guys just really aren't excited about this box, you can go ahead and cancel and just keep unboxing all the other boxes that we have on this channel because there are a lot of them. <laughs> but anyway, please just let me know all of your thoughts and opinions down below. I would love to hear anything you have to say about this box or unboxings in general. If you have a different box that you guys would kind of like me to work in into our unboxings, let me know. I really, really want you guys to have a say in what we do here. But anyway, that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you so very much for watching. Please go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. Like I said, if you enjoy unboxings, this is the channel for you. We currently do have have a ColourPop giveaway running right now so you can go ahead and use the link down below to enter to win this set here by ColourPop and Hello Kitty. It is a super adorable and I'm very excited to give it away to some lucky winner. All you have to do is be subscribed to this channel and leave a comment over on the giveaway video and then you're entered to win. And we will be doing these types of giveaways monthly so we definitely have a shot to win every single month. But anyway I just hope you guys are having an absolutely fantastic day and I will see you next time. Bye!